Hello, everybody, and welcome to Digium Live. We're excited to meet with Granier Fuentes from Bit Platforms. He's one of the uh, Digium partner, and we're excited to talk to him about what they offer and give you some tips about uh, looking for a new phone system. So, welcome, Granier. Thank you. All right. So, tell us about Bit Platforms and what you do. Uh, well, Bit Platforms is a uh, managed uh, service provider uh, here in South Florida. Um, we focused on three areas uh, uh, in the IT uh, business. We focus on IT solutions, hosted infrastructure, IT management. Uh, compliance and and so on. We uh, do software development, um, uh, custom software development for that matter, and we um, also um, resell cloud and and host it uh, on premise actually uh, solutions for and obviously the Digium. Right. Um, well, we also do uh, uh, Cisco solutions, but we we're pushing Digium more and more and, uh, as. Most of our clients are finding Digium a better option for them from the reliability, the usability, the performance, and uh, obviously the price standpoint. Uh, oh, perfect. Uh, so you guys are uh, have become a, a one-stop shop for us to offer great services to, to our clients. So we, we're very glad that, uh, that we, we decided to uh, add Digium to our uh, line of business. So okay, perfect. So um, let's kind of talk, if I'm a new customer coming to Bit Platforms and I'm interested in a phone system, um, what kind of things do you ask me? What are you looking for when you go into a new business um, to see if they're ready for a new phone system? What kind of questions do you ask to get them started? Usually, um, you know, uh, when I, I see an analog phone laying around, that's the first time that they, they need to, to move to a, a new right. system. Because, yeah. uh, and when I approach them and talk to them about it, they usually don't, don't know about uh, unified communications. They don't. They don't know about having an extension on their cell phone and be able to take their office calls right from the cell phone and having all the flexibility of by changing a status on on your voice over IP system, you can have your system completely reconfigure itself on a, sure. on a click of a button. Yeah. So usually, um, I approach them and I, I uh, right away I start giving them a, a live preview of what Digium. Uh, is this is what a voice over IP system is and how easy it is and I actually jump right on the live demo because uh, obviously my I, I'm a user myself of, uh, okay. of Digium so so we have the user portal and the administration portal so so I give them a, a very quick uh, overview of my mobile extension and the portal how it looks how simple it is and how you don't require any tools Right. To, to be able to manage your phone system from any connected device uh, anywhere in the world. Right. So, and then we, from there, we uh, definitely, it, it gets their interest. And then uh, when we're ready to talk some more about it, uh, and it becomes a more mature uh, conversation and something like it's looking like it's going to happen, obviously we start looking all the way from the ISP down. Right. Is your internet connection reliable? How many users um, uh, are you interested in hosting your own uh, appliance, or are you looking at uh, a cloud solution? Uh, sure. we, we're actually pushing cloud uh, just because of the overhead uh, that you yeah. save, uh, uh, you know, from a uh, technical standpoint. Right. So usually, and what I found is that most of the users that uh, that have, uh, you know, 25 uh, and less users, they prefer the cloud option, obviously, okay. because of, from the investment standpoint. Mm -hmm. And then anybody that's 25, 30 users and above, uh, they usually prefer the on the on premise uh, solution. So we, we play it by ear. Right. If they go with a cloud solution, we start looking at download and upload speed from the, the ISP down to their switching uh, infrastructure. Mm -hmm. um, you know, if they have uh, any vo uh, voice over IP enabled switches or and if they don't, obviously we got the power option. Sure. But uh, at least if we have some level of QoS uh, within the, the switching infrastructure, so we can prioritize uh, the voice. Right. So actually, it's interesting. So talking about networks. So if I'm a customer looking at a voice over IP system, what things from a network perspective do I need to have to get ready? Uh, usually, and any um, uh, switch or firewall it depends on. How big your network is. Some some of the users only have one firewall, and they have five computers laying around, so mm -hmm. they all hooked up to it. But at least that it has a, a, a QoS, a quality of service capabilities, to be able to give voice traffic a priority and have them have a great experience. Okay. Uh, it, and and that's a, a requirement for us because we don't want a, a user uh, to have a bad experience because obviously it'll 
you know, put a bad stamp on our name and, and Dijon's name, and we don't really want to do that. Right. Yeah. So, so we, we, we usually start there. Once we uh, overcome that, then we move on into the options, which are uh, great as far as pricing and, you know, getting it up and running. Uh, and the, the experience has been great, uh, to be honest. So what have you seen that's really separating Switchbox from a lot of the competition that's out there? What are some of the key things that you see that are different? Uh, usually when, when I uh, walk into a customer and they tell, they ask me, why should I go with Digium? Why is this Digium your solution? I, I tell, it's simple, it's inexpensive, and it works. It's a system that's uh, constantly updated. Uh, it, it's reliable, it performs. Uh, to, to meet and exceed the expectations, and you get the quality that you're looking for on a, on a voice over IP system. Um, and then whatever we promise, we know we can deliver because of the, of the Digium uh, switch box uh, system. Right. Okay. And, and, we're, and, and like I mentioned earlier, we're moving away from uh, more and more from, from Cisco just because the management, you can be that. Sure. Uh, and, and Digium has, has created a, a a one stop for us as far as uh, being able to uh, resell a voice over IP solution to, to our customers. And, Good. and up to this point, uh, we haven't had, uh, uh, and even prior to B platforms, uh, which I did a lot of installations, we haven't had an unhappy user. That's so all, great we, news. all we have to to say is that, you know, nothing but good things about uh, Digium's reliability, uh, performance, and, and uh, service level for, for our customers. So we're very happy, and that's what we look for on a, on a partner, so offer a great solution. Great. Great. I appreciate your time, and have a great rest of the show. And thank you. All right, thanks. Thank you for joining us, and we'll see you next time on Digium Live.